All right. Good afternoon, everybody. Thanks for tuning in. This is Drink Manila. Um, happy hour. Tip your bartender. My name is Icy Marinas, and thank you so much for coming uh, for tuning in today. So um, I'm going to be introducing um, a special bartender. Um, his name is uh, Glenn uh, Talavera, and um, he's going to be um, show. He he is going to be the uh, showcased bartender for today. Um, but before that, I would like to share with you, if this, if this is the first time you've, uh, you've um, joined us on Tip Your Bartender, uh, I just wanted to, um, to just give you a few, uh, uh, just share with you a few things about the Tip Your Bartender. So Tip Your Bartender was born out of the pandemic from uh, Drink Manila. And um, it is a way for us to help local, the local bartending community during these times. Um, so every Friday, Drink Manila Happy Hour, we showcase a bartender um, who shares, who's going to be sharing a tasty uh, cocktail recipe that the, but that you, you the viewers, can, um, can do at home and also uh, promote a small business that they've started during, or, uh, dur during the, the duration of the quarantine. So you guys as viewers can show your love by supporting the featured bartender's business and also you can also directly tip them via Gcash. So, um, if you guys have been to bars before, which I'm sure you most of you have, um, and if you know you've you've gone to bars and you've uh, genuinely enjoyed um, uh, the insightful uh, the entertainment or some insights coming from uh, your favorite bartenders, usually at the end of the night you do give them a tip just to show them your appreciation. Um, but uh, today we have something special also um, also going on because um, Maker Smart has um, supported uh, supported Tip Your Bartender today, and they will be um, giving away a bottle of Maker Smart um, whiskey bourbon to the highest tipper um, for this episode. So you have today until uh, next week. We're going to be announcing the winners by next week. Um, I just have to double check with uh, with that. We're going to be announcing the winners on Tuesday, is it? Um, and uh, we're going to be giving you a free bottle of uh, Maker Smart that is in support of um, you guys also supporting your favorite bartenders or you know your 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 um, if, if you just truly just enjoyed um, uh, hearing their story and also uh, you know learned a thing or two. Um, we're going to be we're going to be giving away that uh, bottle. So just to introduce you again um, in a few minutes. I'm just making sure that um, Glenn is already ready. But uh, Glenn Talavera, just to give you a background, um, you know, he's if if um, if you do like going out and you know into cocktails really, and you've been doing the rounds like um, in the best bars in Manila, um, he would be a familiar face that you would see. Also, to um, as a bartender, you know, he's one of the more um, how do you say this? More popular um, bartenders uh, who basically befriends pretty much everybody. He's also, um, so apart from being a bartender, I think before he started becoming a bartender, he has a background of IT and, and graphic design. Um, he's been a bartender for more than six years. Uh, I know that, you know, he set up a company or he set up a small bar in La Union uh, before called After Sesh. And then he started working for Bitters. I'm not sure if it's the other way around. Let, let, let's, let's go and ask uh, Glenn later. Uh, and then he became, uh, and then now, you know, he's, he's, he's back in uh, Manila. And uh, uh, he's actually working with a bar um, called, um, called Ola. So it's very interesting he's going to be talking about that. So, so, so today he's going to be talking about the business that he's gotten into because he does have a background of graphic design you know he's like a chameleon and he has a lot of he has a lot of his um hands in um different pockets you know he's a uh, he's like a, a magician of sorts because he does a lot of things different things he does does bartending he does graphic design he has a company uh which he'll be talking about later that um makes um stickers and i know he's been uh quite busy uh, especially over the pandemic because uh a lot of companies have started up their new businesses and they've been needing his services. Uh, so he's been, you know, doing well with that uh, in support of um, his uh, regular job, I guess, as a bartender with Ola. But um, things are looking up for him. Uh, there's going to be a lot of things he's going to be sharing with us. And without further ado, I'm going to be calling him in. 
Okay, I think we've lost him, but um, just before I call him in, I'm going to be playing. Should I play this video or should we just start waiting for Glenn again? I think he lost the feed. Okay, so while we're waiting for Glenn, I'm, I'm going to be, as I mentioned earlier, um, Maker's Mark is sponsoring us today, uh, sponsoring the bartender actually today. Uh, they're, they're, they're vouching... Um, they're, they're vouching a bottle of uh, bottle for Glenn as well, and also um, a gift certificate, a cash gift certificate for um, for Glenn for uh, sharing his story uh, on this show today. So I hope you guys uh, are interested also in having your own Maker's Mark. You know, if you want to have this bottle, of course, it's going to be set the new bottle. I already started drinking this, uh, but if you guys want to have a bottle of Maker's Mark, uh, we can send you one. All you need to do is. Join in today and tip Glenn. Be the highest tipper. You can tip 10 pesos, 20, 100 pesos. The highest tipper from today until um, uh, next week, um, you get a chance to win a bottle of Maker's Mark. So uh, tip Glenn through his Gcash. It's going to be flashed on here. You're going to look at it. It's it's right there. It goes straight to him. So also, uh, we'll be rewarding you with um, a bottle of... Um, Maker's Mark. So while we're waiting for Glenn because he's having some technical difficulties, I'm going to be just, you know, making my own drink while we're waiting. So since um, Maker's Mark is one of my favorite brands to make old fashions with, it's one of my favorite cocktails, I'm going to make one with you. And I hope that um, you also have a, if you have um, a glass or a, a, a spirit ready there, please, you know, go and uh, make yourselves a, a nice cocktail as well. So for people who are not familiar with an old fashioned, old fashioned is one of the oldest um, cocktails uh, ever made. So I'm going to be needing um, a, um, a glass mixer, a mixing glass. Super easy ingredients. You know, it's just you just need ice, a lot of ice. Of course, whiskey, bourbon, um, some sugar. I'm not going to be using sugar, but I'm going to be using one of my because I'm feeling a little bit fancy. I'm going to be using. Okay, which is not here. Yes. Okay, yeah. So I'm going to be using a little bit of um, um, sugar syrup, and then I'm going to just going to be adding a little bit of um, of cold brew from this really interesting uh, company that's called Kata Cafe, which will be featuring um, probably, hopefully, by next week as well. So I'm just going to be mixing that, and I'm going to make myself a little bit of an old. Um, I'm going to make myself a riff with an old fashioned. Okay. So, I'm going to start with my whiskey, Maker's Mark. So, I'll be doing 60 for this, 60 measures. If you guys don't have a jigger, you know, you can use a cap or a, a shot glass or um, um, tablespoon. A tablespoon is 10 ml. So, if you don't have any of those, I'm sure everybody has a, a tablespoon at home. Um, when you're mixing your cocktails, make sure you always measure them because when you measure them, you always have a consistent, you know, quality cocktail. So for you to do that, you just have this. So we'll have so I have my my bourbon, a few drops of a few drops of um, bitters. So I'll be be using Angostura bitters. Okay, just around three dashes of that. And then um, just a little bit of this cold brew, just to flavor. Right. And a bit of um, sugar syrup again. Just a little bit. So I'm just adding maybe around um, 7 ml of um, sugar syrup. I don't want it too sweet. I just want it balanced, and I'm going to be adding some ice. I'm going to be just using my my hand here. Okay, let me chill my glass. Okay. Sorry, I'm using my hands. I cleaned it earlier. Okay. There you go. Make sure you have enough ice because, you know, if there's something that – if there's something – uh, wrong that you can do when you're making your cocktails is to make cocktails with not enough ice. So I have a lot of ice here, so I'm gonna just be. It's an easy stir. Usually you stir for around um, maybe 10 to 15 seconds, it depends on the dilution that you want. 
So I'm going to make sure that it's nice and cold. And I have my uh, my glass ready here, ready chilling. A nice big block of ice. So it's easy. This is an old-fashioned Maker's Mark sugar syrup, bitters. Um, I usually would like to use a sugar cube, but I don't have a sugar cube, so I just use a sugar syrup. And a little bit of cold brew. So it's a, you know, cold, cold brew old-fashioned. Right. I think that's cold. Just a little bit of a taste. That's perfect. Just a pour slowly. Right. Put it on the side. And then, of course, I'm going to be going for this. Okay. Okay. While I'm looking now again for my um, for my knife, I'm going to be adding my, my orange peel in a bit later. But now, I think Glenn is ready. So without further ado, I'm going to be get putting him putting him on right now you ready glenn Hi. hey glenn <laughs> hello how are you sorry i had to make a drink before you made your drink because i was trying to buy you some time uh hindi kita nakita kanina nawala ka ano nangyari nawala yung ano yung connection <laughs> wala yung connection yes yung talagang problema pag nagla live ka you know these things they really happen but anyway welcome to tip your bartender glenn i'm excited to interview here and i see that you have this beautiful display of like your the the cocktails the bottled cocktails that you guys are serving in uh, selling in uh, ola how have you been kamusta Ay, okay naman okay naman okay so we were i know i was just discussing kanina kinikwento ko nga uh, about you um, mm -hmm. sabi ko parang ang description ni Christmas sa iyo parang kang chameleon kasi ang dami mong ginagawa. Um, uh, <laughs> oh. ka. Tapos meron kang sticker business which I think is really really interesting kasi yung mga na-interview namin before, the ones that we've been interviewed uh before, mostly they they've been selling during the pandemic um mm -hmm. drinks. So, you know, healthy drinks, uh horchata, cocktails, diba? milk tea, Ikaw naman, yes, yes. okay yung ano mo, okay yung uh, okay yung gimmick mo sa pandemic kasi before this pandemic nag-start ka na, right? You already started your business. So instead of for first stickers, like making drinks, ang ginagawa yes. mo, ikaw yung nagsusupply naman ng mga stickers for the logos of the drinks. So, yes, kwentuhan yes. mo, tell us about that. Sa so, ano, sa sticker business. Ano siya? Um yun niya, may what, ano, you know, may sticker business again. Uh, stick it easy PH. Stick it easy. So, nag-start siya, ano, um, may nagtanong sa mga bartenders kasi, yun niya, uh, nag-close yung mga bar, so, pinasok nila yung mga online business. So, may isang bartender nagtanong sa'yo kasi nagpapagawa ng, ano, ng stickers for labels daw. So, tinulungan ko siya. Then, after a week, may nagtanong ulit, sa so, so, pwede yung paggawa ng ganito, pag ganyan. So, doon ko siya naisip na para hindi na maghanap para ng ibang supplier. So, pinasok yung stickers para mag-supply sa kanila na pwedeng, pwedeng, pwede kang kumuha ng kahit isang sheet lang or konti lang, sampung piraso. So, uh -huh. kung tinatry, tinatry pa lang nila yung business nila, so, yun, hindi siya ganun, hindi ka gagas agad ng malaki. So, okay. doon siya so, nag-start. So, walang minimum. Wala, so, walang minimum. minimum. Maganda wala. yung ganyang sa problema kasi minsan sa mga suppliers, when you buy from them, you have to have a minimum, di ba? Yeah, but kailangan marami good, good decisions. Or, yes. oh, good decisions yun na yun ginawa mo yan. Yung mga, yung mga hindi kasi nagbibusiness ngayon, hindi pa naman sila sigurado talaga. So, parang tinatry lang nila oh. para kumita din. Ganun. So, kaya ako siya pinasok. Para hindi na rin sila lalayo. Tapos, uh, at least kilala din nila ako. Or ano. So, madali ko sila matulungan. Kung baga, yun siya. Great. So, ah, sige. So, ang dami mo mga clients. Ako, I'm gonna be your future client. Alam, may, alam ko, sinabi ko, may mga, may mga papagawa na ako for you. <laughs> um, but like that's that's amazing. Stick it, stick it easy, right? So how long have you had yes. stick it easy? Because I don't know before pa ng pandemic mm. yan. Hmm. De, nag-start na ako May lang, May nine for the secret. Ah, May lang. Yes, yun nga, yun, okay, but you sa already. Akin. Yes. So I ikaw ba yung ano, okay? So aside, yung ano? Ah, uh, you're also like you know you're you're a bartender and then you're um you have a sticker business. 
Um, I know that also you also founded uh, DBWI, di ba? One of the founders ka ng DBWI with Rian. Yes, yes. Oh, yes. Yeah. So, are you the one who did all the graphic design for DBWI? Uh, yes. Oh. Ah, so ikaw din pala. Oh, okay. Wow, oh. congratulations. I really like I really like yung, ano, yung design mo for uh, DBWI. I like it. Gustong gusto ko yung, yung uh, design mo na yan. Ah, may birthday. Sino yun? Sino may, may guest. birthday? Guest, tapos ah, yung chef namin. Tsaka isang bartender namin din si Charlie. Birthday niya. Ah, wow. Yes, happy, so, happy. Tapos yung dalawang chef okay, namin, so, birthday ngayon. Ah, wow. Happy birthday yeah. to them. So, meron bang ano, meron yeah. bang a little party with social distancing dyan mamaya? Mm, baka. Baka kain na ng konti. <laughs> Okay. So aside from ano, so you have your stick it easy. Ano pa yung what 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 is keeping you busy right now? Mm, yun, uh, since open na rin kasi yung Ola. So nag gagawa nag gagawa kami dito ng pwede namin ilabas this July or sa susunod na buwan na para may survive din yung ano, yung bar bar and restaurant namin. So may mga ilalabas kami mga bottle cocktails, mga pa, uh, food packs ganyan. So ganyan. Kaya andito rin so, ako lagi. Mapasok na rin ako. So great. So, yeah. uh, so but regular ka na po mapasok ngayon? Yes. After nang pag so, ako, pagkagawa ng mga clients, pupunta ako dito. So speaking of um, bottled cocktails that you're doing now, you're not uh, selling the, the bottled cocktails on a personal, uh, for, for you personally, pero you're designing the, the cocktails for Ola, right? Yes. Um, can you can you show us how to make a, so so you guys are mga hottest products new for Ola for the bottled cocktails is your sangria and I know you yes. you're gonna be showing us how you guys make the sangria. Hmm. Oh, sangria. Yung Ola sangria namin. Actually, siya yung ano namin yung bestseller namin yun. Siya yung mabilis sa mga bottled cocktails namin. So yun. Sige. Um, Great. Sige. So sige. Show us how to make it. So guys, you know if you guys sige. are thirsty, you don't have a yeah. you don't have a cocktail. Uh, yet for tonight or for this afternoon mm-hmm. for a happy hour, you can actually mm-hmm. go and just message uh, Glenn as well and uh, order a few uh, bottled cocktails from Ola. You can do that for you guys, or or if you're more interested with this sticker business uh, because you're thinking of uh, setting up your own business, you can also message him. So, guys, just as a reminder, we're going to be giving away a bottle of uh, Maker's Mark today. So, you know, don't forget to tip uh, Glenn. Okay. Okay, go Glenn. So, Ready? yan, start. Based nang ano namin, wala sang reason, ano, um uh pineapple infused rum. So, pineapple infused rum. How long did you infuse the pineapple for? Ano lang to, uh 24 hours lang yung pinaka ano niya. Then, uh homemade spicy mango. Asa so, ginagamit namin is uh, local wine. Local wine siya is ano, uh, Bugnay wine from ano, proud uh, from the. Tas ano siya, wow. ginagamit spices then then. Uh, I ano, love that product. Uh, yes, yeah, so okay siya, okay siyang gamitin. So inipis din namin siya uh, sa mga spices, so para mold wine siya. Oh, nice. I like I like uh, the products of uh mm. of that company. From the proudly Philippine made. Yes. So these are things that pwede mong gawin, no? I mean, you know, you're you have a new you have new products, but you can support mm. local. That's a very important now. Yo, tama. So tell us tell us more about uh, what you're doing with Ola. I know na di ba, di, you set up a you set up a bar in La Union dati. Mm-hmm. Tapos, ano yung name noon? After Sesh, di ba? After after Sesh. Oh. Ano and siya, then bali? yung after session. After session and then um yung bar ng Ola is after session. Sorry, after can, session. can after session. explain after mo session. nga yan? After ano siya, session. Uh, no, nag-start siya sa La Union talaga. Para ano lang din, tambayan. So, kaya tinawag siya after session. Uh, after nung surfing. Like uh, 7 p.m. onwards. Ganyan. So, after session nila. After mag after lang mag-session ng surfing. After mag-surf. Uh-oh. Oh, okay. Ganun siya. So, is- start namin yun um, 2000, uh, 2015. 
sa La Union. So, pa- maraid lang siya, parang kubo lang, walang upuan. So, bar lang, tapos nakatayo lahat ng tao. Then, party-party pagka hanggang madaling araw, ganyan siya. How, so, siya how, long, how long mo yun ginawa? Ah, uh, parang tumagal siya six or seven months lang doon sa La Union. Kasi, ano eh, renovate yung lugar doon. Na pinagkatayuan niya. Mm-hmm. Oh, partner ko noon, ano, ah, partner bar namin, Surfstar. Doon sa may Surfstar yun eh. So, parang ganyan siya. So, sinarado namin, then bumalik ako sa Manila. So, yun. Pagbalik na Manila, shake ko muna, baka malusaw. <laughs> so, yun go, siya. Go, 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 go. Sa Sangria, shake natin. Ano siya, um, pineapple infused rum. Then, spicy mango. Si, spicy mango. Tapos, uh, bugnay wine. Tsaka, grilled pineapple. Ang ano niya. So, ano siya, dito. So for those who don't know what bugnay wine is, I guess this 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 sangria is quite special because normally sangrias are made out of uh, you know uh, wine from the grape variety. Pero yung for for uh, Glen Sangria, he uses a local fruit wine. Yes, bugnay local. wine. Mm. Ano siya? Um. Hmm. So Siya. Then, tap namin ng ano to, ng ginger ale. Ah, ginger wow. Ale so, it's a nice so, light, ano, nice light, parang, parang sangria highball. Mm, <laughs> ano siya. So, and then, nagarin siya namin siya ng ano eh, ng dried pineapple. Yung pinagbabara namin, yun na rin na namin eh, parang uh, pinagagarish namin. So, para ano kasi namin dito, Uh, lahat nung ginagamit namin sa mga infusions or ano, hinahanapan namin na iba pang gagamitin. Pwede sa kitchen, pwede sa bar. Yes. So, yan. Walang waste. Siya. That's very good. I love that. Yes, oh. yes. So, yan. Um, Zero waste po. policy sa bar. Yes, ganun. Tsaka, then yung ano namin dito, parang sustainability. So, may mga, yung mga tanim namin dito, yun din sinaserve namin. Dito, dito kami kumukuha Di ng mga herbs, ganyan. Di- Lahat. Hindi pa ako nakaka-visit sa inyo pero I'll I'll visit you soon maybe I'll take a uh, Christmas and star also pag medyo pwede na. Um, mm-hmm. Visit kami yan sa inyo for sure. Yeah. Okay, so, so that's your what what is this? What is it? Ito yung ano, Ola Sangria natin. So, ito siya. Sa bottle. Ah. Okay. I am having some difficulty with this. Oh, maybe we can like an uh What's going on? Oh no. Hi, sorry. Ah, uh, nawala ako. <laughs> Had a problem with my internet, but I hope everything was okay. Sorry, may tumatawag pa. That's a problem with having link, no? Kung ano nangyayari, wala akong masyadong control. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, um, looking forward to trying that uh, Bugnay yeah. style uh, sangria. That's really nice. Very mm. Filipino Filipino uh, style sangre. And that's something different. Guys, if you, and, and that's available now. You can order yes, from what time one. to what time, Glenn? Uh, open kami ng, ano, uh, 11 to 9. Pwede siya. Deliveries. 11 to 9. Yes, takeouts. Then, dine-in din. Medyo malaki naman yung ola. So, nasusunod na may 30% capacity na. Layo-layo kami. Yeah. Sige. Malapit-lapit na ako. Pupunta ako dyan. Pupunta talaga ako dyan. Ano na ako, excited na excited na ako lumabas dahil, syempre, you know, Ilang bon ka ba naman na sa sa bahay? Of course, you wanna be going out. So there's a lot of mm-hmm. friends uh, of yours, uh, uh, Glenn. Nagsisay hi sila. Nakikita mo ba? Hindi. 
Hindi. <laughs> yung nakikita yung mga ano nila. So, uh, well, yeah. let's just flash it over here. Um, mm-hmm. Starting off here. Yan. Saying hi. Of course, Nino's here. One of your um, co-founders in uh, DBWY. Yes, yeah, so DBWY. <laughs> Ito, si Miss Nikki. James. Nag-hello. Ang dami kang mga ano, ang dami kang mga friends na sa online na nagme-message din. So okay, so um let's talk about more about uh yung ano ren. Balik tayo dun sa ano sticker business mo. It's really I find it really yeah. interesting. How many how many companies or how how many how many startup companies have you serviced already? Kasi hindi ka naman limited lang sa sa ano, 'di ba? Ito yung sa um, ba, for for people just watching us, yeah. These are samples yeah. of Glenn's work. So, you know, you have well-known bars already having uh, using him as uh, his sticker, their sticker supplier. So you have food, beverage, ano pa? Ano pang mga companies yung mga na... Diba, mar- na marami ta- din eh. Mar- mga construction companies like that. Ano din, uh, siguro mga start-up nasa 50 na rin, 50 companies na rin. DJs yan, DJs. Ano din, wow. mayala pang mga, mga cyclists, uh, meron din. So, what else do you do aside from um, stickers? So, you also do graphic work? Mm, How about dati, website? Dati, dati, yung company namin, yun, gumagawa kami website, yung uh, Obra Digital. Gumagawa, mm-hmm. dun, dun ako galing. So, parang all eyes, um, sister company yung Obra, JBSI. Actually, maraming, ano yun eh, maraming kasama. So, doon ako galing dati, before i-open yung Ola. Doon ako nag-graphic so, design, ganyan, ganyan. So, so, yung background mo talaga, before, IT ka talaga. So, you, you've been doing IT for the longest time. So, anong story? What's, what is what is Glenn's story? Yeah, um, yung mga ginagawa ko ngayon, mas, kung, na, kung mga pinag-ano ako profession, wala akong ano doon, background talaga. So, kung, yun nga, kung saan ako mapunta, okay. doon ako. <laughs> para ka talagang ano ha kung sa tip sa tumihip ng hangin doon ka pero but's great because you know yeah. madaming hindi hindi lahat ng tao ganyan you know not everybody can seize an opportunity mm. and grab it and you know try to learn something so ang dami mo talagang mga different hats si really you really are a chameleon so but nakikita <laughs> yes. ko na nakikita ko based on doon sa mga nagawa mong mga trabaho na very creative ka Ano yung mm-hmm. background mo from ano school? Ano nag anong nag ano ka ba? From school ano yung mga hilig mo na courses before? Ano mga hilig mo na classes? You've always been creative because mm-hmm. you always you you seem like you've been always gravitating to still creating things. Yes. Kung na bartend ka, nagkakreate ka ng drinks, may creativity yan, may artistry. Graphic design, yes. mahilig ka din diyan, 'di ba? Oh, so mm-hmm. anong anong meron? Anong anong meron si Glenn? Um Dati talaga gusto ko magano mag computer science pero hindi kasi ako nag college eh. so high school graduate okay. yan. So doon nag okay. ano parang after high school doon lahat ng tas tambay ko one year kanya ron tambay nasa mapunta ko sa Baguio ganyan Baguio first work ko doon ano um hardinero <laughs> Ganun siya Wow yes Talent, so kung saan ako ka. Yes <laughs> I was from from that so, from that um sa school Yun, uh, tagabantay kami yung school, kasi wala kami sa school, mga parang mga special child school, ganyan, special school. Okay. Then, bagyo pa rin, dun ako, na, dun ako nag-start sa computer, naging technician ako dun. <laughs> okay. Naging technician. Wow. And yeah. self-taught ka lahat, self-study. Yes, yes, ganun, lahat. So, parang pag may gusto kong gawin, pag may gusto kong gawin, tapos nakita ko, mayroon akong nakilala dun, tagang aaralin ko siya. Kakaibiganin ko siya, aralin ko siya. So, hindi ko naman sila ginagamit. Gusto ko lang matuto. Kasi nga, gano'n siya. Galing, galing sa ano lang din. So, lahat. Lahat, lang, lahat. lahat lang po pwede. Lahat lang po pwedeng gawin na kung kaya naman. But di, kaya siya subukan din. So, pagka nag, nag-okay, dire-dire-direcho ko siya. Gano'n siya. I, I, I know also, uh, nagra-rap ka, di ba? You have a, a small group of like, friends also from the bartending community. Ano na nangyari doon? Meron ba? Meron bang performance today? Si Joey ata magpe-perform eh. Si Joey. Si ano, si Wansha. Nasa na? Nasa na umiinom si Joey? Pa, umiinom pa daw siya. Papalakas ng loob. <laughs> umiinom, nagpapalakas ng loob so mamaya magpa-perform ha? Hindi <laughs> ko alam doon. 
<laughs> so okay, so over so during yeah. the pandemic, um so naging busy ka talaga. I mean until now busy ka. Dahil ang dami yeah. nagre-request ng mga stickers sa iyo. So parang oh. talagang sobrang you know, you're one of the blessed. But you're blessed also kasi Siyempre, nagtrabaho ka din eh. Madami ka rin pinundar. Yes. Di ba? Madami mm. ka rin sinet up para mm. narip mo yung benefits nung sa pandemic. Was mm. there anything else na during the pandemic, um, ano yung feeling mo nung nangyari yun? Ano yung first, in, yung first na inisip mo nung nangyari yung lockdown? Tapos yan, lahat na ng, ano, lahat ng information about the virus lumabas. Anong, anong na-feel mm. mo dun? Ano, siyempre, uh, nalungkot, di ba? Parang nabago lahat kasi, nabago lahat. Pero, yun naman, kahit sa, ano kami, uh, swerte kami sa company namin din. So, nag-pandemic, ganyan. Hindi naman kami pinabaya. So, so, ano, supportado pa rin kami, kahit pa paano. Financial, ganyan. Hanggang sa magbukas ulit yung ola. Doon pa rin. Parang, nasa, um, tag dito, dire-diretso pa rin kami, pero yun nga, um, nabago lang. Ah, uh, like sa mga ano sa mga araw-araw pupunta rito may mga kasama ang iba nami-meet may ibang tao uh-huh. ganyan so ngayon eh nung bumalik parang nakakapanibago nakakapanibago pupunta dito walang tao sobrang ano sobrang tahimik ganyan siya parang malungkot malungkot oh malungkot kasi syempre bartender ka sa, kaya ka, kaya mo sigurong gusto na bartender kasi gusto mo nagso-socialize, di ba? Tapos para na mawala hmm. yung aspect na yun. Bigla, bigla na wala. Why do you ako. think? Oo, di ba? Parang, Tapos, parang like nasanay. it's off kagad, eh, no? Oo. Oh, parang nasanay ka na rin sa bahay. Wala nang ingay. Wala na, oo. Oh. Wala nang ingay, ba, walang, walang ano. Oh. So where do you where do you see um, yourself? With the sticker business ba, may mga partners ka na iba dyan? Meron, meron naman. Meron, meron din. May mga nag-support din and, sa akin dyan. May mga nakabaka. And, and, uh, and where do you see, and where do you see, um, where do you see yourself with regards dun sa mga stickers? Is this sticker business growing? Is there is this sticker business something na lagi, bigyan mo talaga din ng panahon kasi may nakikita kang opportunity na maganda? Sa so ngayon, ano siya? Sa so ngayon, growing naman. Kasi parang, yun nga, nag-start ako sa industry, mga bartenders, uh, sa mga kilala. Ngayon, may mga ibang clients din na, uh, uh, malalaki din, yung iba, uh, mga kilalang company din. Tapos nagpapagawa sila. Pagka yung rush na, yung kailangan lang nilang konti for samples, yun yan. Ngayon siya. So, lumalaki siya. Kaya okay din. Okay. So, it's good, no? Kasi parang, so, anong nangyari dyan? So, I, I would imagine, syempre, lesson yung days mo na pumapasok at syempre, lesson din yung, yung salary mo. So, um, do you feel happy na parang at least meron kang mga ibang businesses na nakakatulong hindi. din sa support sir, sa'yo? Hindi naman. Sa, yun yan, sabi ko kanina, hindi naman kami pinabayaan ng ano, company. Dire-diretso pa rin kami. So, kahit yung close yung all, dire-diretso pa rin kami. So, parang talaga yung sticker business, side, side gig lang talaga siya. Then yun nga sa eight, uh, sa Bisby video yung mga 8 walls put 8 walls who made natin. Ah, uh, matagal yun na matagal ko nang ginagawa bago ako pumunta ng uh, Ayun, may, mga bars. Ayun, yes, so, Ano nga ba yung name nung pomade mo? May pomade ka din. Ano pa ba ang bebe? Para kang Bombay. <laughs> <laughs> yun nga. Yun, yun nga. Uh, matagal na yun bago pa magano, bago pa ako magpasok sa mga bar. Meron na ako noon. Yun yung partner ko naman do si ano, si 8 walls naman. Ah, uh, taga Bulacan yun. So siya yung susupply ng mga ano, uh, local, locally brew na pomade. So parang support local nga. Yun siya. Support local again. Ano pa ang magbibigay mm. mo mga payo? What other tips can you give to the bartend, other bartenders or, or viewers who need some inspiration during this ano, this time? Anong pwede mong ibigay sa kanila na na ano na, in, na inspiration or anong mga tips, insights na yun, mabibigay um, mo sa kanila? Kung may gusto silang gawin or gusto nilang, ano, uh, gusto nilang kumita pero nahiya sila. Dapat hindi. So kasi, isipin na ibang tao, mga ano, parang, eto nung may trabaho to as bartender, laki ng essay na to, laki ng sahod, laki ng tips, tapos oh. kumakawal na pera. Then, then makikita sila, hindi tindan ako ano-ano, sakali ko ano-ano. Dapat, di na inaano yun. Kasi hindi naman sila, hindi naman yung nagpapakain sa kanila, di ba? So kung isipin nila yun, parang, 
wala, wala mangyayari. Isipin lang nila, pero gutom sila. Parang naisipin lang hiya nila. So, yun, dire-diretso lang, parang, um, kung, baga, kung para sa pamilya mo, para sa, ano mo, sa sarili mo, huwag may sipi ibang tao. So, gawin mo kung ano gusto mong gawin. Kasi, at the end of the day, ikaw, ikaw din din naman yung magugutom, gutom ikaw yung maapektuhan, di ba? So, yun, yun yeah, siya. Yeah, hmm. so, yun, no? like, yun. yes. So, yun, like, yun. Yes. I mean, ang, ang question dyan is, madaming mga, you know, there's a lot of people who are talented, madaming mga bartenders talagang talented. Hmm. But syempre, nangyari yung pandemic, and things are different. Hmm. So, hmm. ang mapapayo mo sa kanila, ang sinasabi mo is, uh, wag silang mahiyang kumita ng ibang ways, di ba? Oh, Mahalap na ibang oh. ways para kumita. Oo, oh, oo. Oh. Kung nas, isipin nila yun, tapos sasabay lang sila. Wala rin, di ba? Isipin nila oh, na ano na. Nandiyan naman yung talent nila, hanap, isipin nila oh. nila kung saan nila i-apply yan. Oo oh, naman, oo. Oh. Kung saan nila pwedeng gamitin para ma- masuportahan, kung sino gusto nila supportahan, pamilya nila, sakili nila. Di ba? Kahit kapit bahay nila. <laughs> Oh, basta yes, ang, ang parang always just find opportunities eh, no? Oo, oh, oh, dapat yung sinasaya. Find the opportunity tapos gawin, uh, gawin mo. Oo no, no, oh, naman, pero dapat opportunity na mabuti. Di ba? Na ma- always dun sa positive. Kailangan always oh, positive. Oh, oh, na, ano daw eh, no? Nagplano, nag, nagplano daw mag ano eh, mag, mag, uh, mag rob ng bangko eh, no? <laughs> <laughs> opportunity. <laughs> yeah. Oh. So, yun. Yeah. So what else can you ano? So um, okay, so nung during the pandemic, meron ka bang natutunan na bago? Aside from I mean, alam ko kasi ikaw mahilig ka pag meron ka nakitang gusto mong t- matutunan, anong uh, anong ginawa mo during the pandemic? Did you meron ka bang mga like for example for bartending, meron ka bang things na pinag-aralan, binasa, nag try to improve yourself on? Yes, ga uh, ang Ang yun, nagkaroon kasi rin ako ng time para mag ano, mag research, mag-aral. So yun nga, yung bago namin lalabas na mga cocktail, yun yung parang ano namin, um yun isip ko na gawin na wala pang gumagawa. So this July lalabas namin siya. Mga battle cocktails namin. Wow. Yeah. So yun. So July pa. Pero July, July na ngayon eh, pero when exactly? July na ngayon, pwede na bang orderin ah, yan? Pero pa tayo yung menu. Siguro next week pa yung ano may, may menu yung ano yung ola sa page namin na yung mga binebenta namin yun for takeouts battle cocktails uh, okay. food packs meron frozen foods meron din kami so gumagawa na rin kami nun so we can just, lang so you guys are so, so ola is on uh, Facebook and Instagram also so ola meron with an na. H-O-L-A eat drink play ola eat drink play siya kasi maraming ola eh, na ano na pag sinerge mo marami lumalabas. So sa amin all eat drink play. Na ano? All eat drink play. So if you guys want to order um great tasting um cocktails, um how long is the shelf life of the sangria? Yung mga cocktails. Mm, sang- sangria is ano eh, uh, ito one week kasi hindi naman siya hindi naman siya lalagyan ng fresh lemon. So ginagamit ko yung ano um parang uh, uh, Lemon Rancho ng ano, ng, pero konti lang kasi yung ano na to, sour. So hindi rin siya ganyan yeah. ano. Hmm. Tapos niluluto so, ko sinayang ingredients din. So matagal-tagal ang shelf life. Uh, one week so siguro. So pasteurized uh, siya. Mga one mm-hmm. week, it's still good. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's good to know. So ano, ikaw din ba nag-design ng ano nila? Anong mga stickers nila dyan? Sa mga Ola, logos nila? Sa Ola, itong after search na design namin. Ang nag-design na to si, ano, si Oggs. So, yung story yung friend ko rin na ano, na artist na ano, siya yung design nito. Kasi ginamit namin siya sa lahat. Pati yung sa may labas ng ola, siya yung nagpaint noon. Ayun. The met stickers. Pwede so, merong nag-message, Dina, yes. Miss Dina Ubas, pwede ba daw live tipping? Pwedeng-pwede. Mag-tip kayo, you guys get this bottle of uh Maker's Marks for people who just joined us. Um Please don't forget to tip Glenn. Nandiyan yung uh nandiyan yung uh GCash number niya. You can tip him directly. You can even message him for orders or if you're interested in having stickers done by him. But um for today, Maker's Mark is supporting us. Makakatanggap ka pala ng bottle ng Maker's Mark and then may GC kami. May papadala kaming GC sa from Maker's Mark. 
uh, because this is some uh, this is a way for them to support you guys as bartenders also. So exciting yan. Sino kayong mananalo? Sino kayong magiging highest tipper sa iyo ano? Sa tingin mo? Sa tingin mo ano, Glen? Sino ba ang mga pwedeng mag-tip diyan? Hello. Oh, eh, live tipping pala. Ah, dito pala. Oh, sila. there's live tipping. Oo, <laughs> <laughs> dami lang tipo. <laughs> wow, galing. Labas. Dami tip pala. Ah, dito pala sila binibisit. Binibisita lang si Charlie Abel kasi birthday. Birthday kasi ng bartender. Wow. Yes. Wow. Sakto. <laughs> Nagulat ako. Okay, yata yeah, talaga live. Nagulat din ako sabi ko live tipping. Okay, pwede naman yung live tipping. Talagang live. Okay. Nandiyan pala talaga sila. Oh my God. So, okay, ipakilista lang. Pakilista lang yung, yung tip nila. Yung name nila. Tapos kung sila yung highest tipper for today. Hopefully sila or meron pang mag, mag, magbibigay ng mas malaking tip sa'yo, then padala natin sila ng Maker's Mark. <laughs> okay. So ano pong, ano, ano pang, ano, Glenn? So, you know, it was really nice to talk to you about it, to talk to you uh, regarding dun sa mga nagawa mo ng mga business at saka how you think. Pero nakaka-inspire ka kasi ano ka eh, Fighter ka eh. Grow mo yun. Hindi ka naman nagtapos ng, hindi ka naman nag-college for, um, for IT or graphic design. Pero yes, nagawa mong matuto kasi talagang pinursigin mo. Paano yun? Nag- uh, what did you do? Nag-YouTube ka tsaka siguro nagpapamentor ka sa iba. Yung, yung parang, karamihan dun, may, ano, may talagang sum- sumuporta sa akin na like sa pagiging technician sa Baguio. Parang not, lunch break, natambay ako sa isang shop. Kasi yung kaibigan ko sila na puro, puro computer casing mas CP yung ganyan. Kalikot sila ng kalikot. Ah. Tapos nung umalis nga ako, pagiging ardinero doon sa si school, sa ila ko ah. So ina- inampo nila ako. Ah. Tinuruan nila ako kung paano gumawa nun. Then yun, uh, hanggang sa lumalabas na ako mag-isa. Parang papadala nila ako sa ganito, pag uh, home service, ganyan. Tapos pag ba hindi ako alam, ah. nagawin like, ano yung gagawin dito? Tetext ko sila, ganyan ito nangyayari, hindi nag-reboot yung computer. Tapos tetext nila sa akin, ganyan ito gawin mo. Kung nasa may ganito, yung memory, ganyan-ganyan. So, hanggang sa magawa ko siya, yung lahat ng kita nun sa akin lang. Binibigay lang sa akin, parang ganyan siya. So, hanggang nagsolo na ako din. Nagsolo na ako, nagsolo na ako, nabuhin ako ng provincia, ng Nueve Sea ulit. So, doon. Tapos, dala ko yun. Sa, sa, sa bayan namin, walang technician. So, okay technician ng bayan namin, parang ganyan. Ang galing ganyan. naman. <laughs> Meron ka pa bang <laughs> shop doon or iniwanan mo na? Wala, matagal na yun. Bago ako punta ng, ano, bago, bago ako punta ng Manila. Wala na yun. May computer shop so, na pinartner naman ako. So when did when did you decide na magpupunta ka ng Manila? So Nueva Ecija, pareho pala kayo ni Tatong, tiga Nueva Ecija din yung si Tatong, yung province niya, Nueva Ecija. Yata. So wow. ikaw naman, so kailan ka nag-decide na alis ka na ng Nueva Ecija, punta ka ng Manila, as in, punta ka ng Manila, nag-technician ka din, at to start Hindi. with. Wala. <laughs> punta lang Manila, oh. wala. Walang plano, walang kung ano yung gusto, kung ano yung papapasukan. Paano yung pupwedeng gawin din sa Manila? So, yun siya. Wala, parang sumama lang din ako dun eh. Malakas, kaya, lang, like, malakas lang talaga loob mo. Tsaka yeah, napakaswerte so, mo. Meron siguro nagbabantay sa'yo. Meron kang guardian angel. <laughs> Kahit sa, <laughs> sa, sa, sa pagpuntang bagyo, inaya lang ako noon na hindi ko siya masyadong close or something. Nakasama ko lang siya sa tambayan dun. Tapos inaya niya ako sa bagyo na pagpunta na. Nangangailangan doon ng trabahador sa ganyan. Sumama lang ako. So, marami din ako natutunan doon. Then Manila, ganun din. Wow. Dire-diretso lang. Walang plano ko ano yung pagsalto ko ng Manila. Hindi ko alam kung ano yung papasoan ko. Kung saan yung hiring, ganun siya. Parang ganun. Pero grabe ah. Ang layo na nang narating mo, Glenn. This is a story <laughs> that um, I never would have known kung hindi kita tinatanong. But I'm glad mm. na tinatanong kita at nalaman ko ngayon. And I hope that um, for people who are watching, uh, you know, it's really inspiring to hear stories like this, you know, real stories from uh, from people. So thank you so much for, you know, sharing your story here. And guys, may nag-tip na ng live kay Glenn. Pero, you know, <laughs> we still have a, you guys still have a chance. You guys still have a chance to support him. Hey, supporting his business, you know, maybe you can, uh, you can call him up and... Uh, uh, and uh, have him uh, do your stickers for, for, for your businesses 
or uh, support him by uh, also buying uh, cocktails, ready to ready to uh, drink cocktails from Ola. Uh, you'll find them Ola, li, I don't live, drink. I don't mean, live Ola, live, drink. What is it, Glenn? Again, how do they find drink you? Drink Ola. Ola eat, drink, play. Eat, drink, so, play. Yes, Ola eat, eat, drink, play. So find them on Instagram and Facebook. Yes. Mm -hmm. And uh, what else? Uh, ano pa bang ano? Yung yung stick it easy mo merong ano Instagram, may Instagram tsaka may mm, Facebook page. Facebook Facebook lang, Facebook lang. Facebook. So if you guys wanna yes. if you guys are establishing a new business uh during this uh period and you'll be needing a supplier for the stickers, uh Glenn has a great uh company who doesn't require minimum orders for stickers. If you guys are just trying things out and you just want a few pieces, you can you can do so. Walang ano, walang uh Walang minimum order. So you can contact Glenn, Glenn uh, straight away mm -hmm. also. So yung, ano niya, Glenn, last parting words mo. Sorry, you're gonna be making also a last cocktail. Diba, dalawang cocktail na gagawin mo. Ano yung next cocktail na gagawin mo pala? Uh, yung ano, um, paraiso. Paraiso siya. So, ayun ko siya. Ano siya made with ano made with mango rum. So ano siya kaya para iso kasi so yung is paradise yes. Paradise rum. I actually oh. this one of, it's I, I really like that product of ano of uh, distillery. Mm. Yeah. Gusto gusto ko yung mango rum na yan. Para siya ano eh, para siyang old fashioned din pero parang cold brew. So hazelnut cold brew. Sunny. Ah, uh, it's orange bitters. People are just joining us again. This is your bartender PH. This is uh, Glenn showing ha showing us his second cocktail for this episode. I hope you guys are enjoying the show. And I hope you guys are tipping Glenn because if you do tip him and if you become the highest tipper, you can you have a chance to win a bottle of Maker's Mark. Thanks again to Maker's Mark for sponsoring today's episode. And uh, the one who tipped you, Kanina. Glenn, yes. Miss Dina, Dina Ubas. The, Dina she's Ubas. a friend of yours, ba? You kanina? Oh, oh she's pinag big time. Regular. Eh. Mm. Ah. Regular namin dito yun. Sano siya uh, dried mango. So ito yun, uh, para iso. Yan. Wow, sarap. Nakakatakam mm. naman yan. I really, Ginawa I really nung miss. Nung... Sagre ah. Ginawa ko nung una, ano, uh, pwede siyang blended version. Eh. So, ito kasi, ano lang. Yeah. So, ito, ano lang, uh, easy. Yung dun mm -hmm. sa uh, cock yung cocktails to go, dun sa bottled cocktails, naka-brew siya. Mm -hmm. Tama ba yan? Yes, Pero sir. this one, uh, hini basically, hinimay-himay mo, kaya pinakita mo mm -hmm. lang yung, yung flavors yes. niya. Uh, I, I really like the, the flavors and excited to try that also. Guys, there are Ola is also open for business now. You guys can uh, dine in or you can yes, take out, you know, whatever you're comfortable yeah. with. Mm. Kamusta pala yung mga, ano, yung mga um, sanitation uh, measures nyo dyan? Strict to ba ah, kayo dyan? Yes, yeah, sobra. At saka nasusunod lahat dito. Kasi mahirap na eh, baka pag nagsarado ulit to, di ba? Oh, ano, ano, uh, na, nangyari the last, oh, no? Di ba? Nakakatakot. <laughs> Oo nga. So lahat nasusunod, nasusunod naman. Nasasunod naman lahat. So yun, pwede silang mag-dine in, take out. Pwede magpa-deliver din kahit saan. Pwede. And, and ano ba yung address nyo? Where do, where do we find you? How, how do we ano? get to see you? Kahit na nakamask ano, kami. Uh, okay, saan ka ano, namin pwede uh, puntahan? Dito sa may Aqua. Sa the pe, uh, Aqua at across the Rockwell. Yes, across Rockwell lang siya. Yeah. And you guys are open from what time to what time? 
11 to 9. 11 to 9. So, guys, if you guys are looking for, again, this is Glenn. And if you guys are looking for uh, stickers for your business, some graphic design, I know he can also take in some uh, some work with that. Pati ba, na mag pati ba si technician, nati-technician ka pa rin hanggang ngayon? Paminsan-minsan? Sa pag ano lang, sarili na lang. <laughs> sarili na lang, hindi na. Or pag may mga malalapit lang, okay lang yun. O oh, sige, baka pwede ka lang kulitin. Anyway, mag-uusap tayo about it. May mga hmm. requirements kami. Then ano, uh, yun, sa CDBWI, meron kaming ano, um, project na gagawin para maka-bounce back din mga bartenders. So, Great. Ano lang. Visit nyo lang yung page ng ano. Visit nyo lang. Abangan nyo lang doon sa page ng DBWI. Yes. Yeah, sige. Just let us know. Just mm. share the information and uh, mm. nice lang. So kami nice naman with Drake Manila we will always share mm. information coming from you guys. Anything to support the industry. Mm. And uh, okay, so guys, uh, thank you so much again. Thank you for the drink. So you served uh, nice sangria and uh, paradiso. Para paradiso ba? Paradiso. Paradiso. Uh, mm. You guys can order para iso. You guys can order this from Ola. Uh, mm. You can find them on fa on Facebook and also on Instagram. So Instagram, uh, Ola Eat Drink Play. Play. Yes. Oh. And then uh, your sticker. And then your sticker company. You can find your sticker company under the name of Aros FB sa Facebook. Stick it easy, PH. Stick it easy, PH. Okay, so stick it easy, PH for all your sticker needs for your businesses for beverage. Uh, well, uh, any 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 uh, sticker that you may need, maybe yung mga stickers nyo for yung for mga COVID stickers. I think uh, stickers. You'll be, a lot of establishments will be needing that. Like me, that's the thing that I need from you also. Um, you can uh, you can support Glenn by uh, by tapping him to do that. Uh, tip him directly on his GCash. Don't forget, uh, get a chance to win a bottle of Maker's Mark for today. We'll be announcing the winners by next week. So you have now until next week to send in your tips to Glenn. Uh, and also, we'd like to thank you again, Glenn, for um, for joining us this in this episode. We're going to be sending you your bottles of maker, uh, your bottle of Maker's Mark and also a GC from them with love. <laughs> show their support to you. With love. Show their support to you. Tsaka, sandali lang. Baka naman pwede ka mag-wrap bago ka umalis. Uh, <laughs> yeah, alam po, it's one of your De. other many, many, many talents. Uh, papadala na lang namin nila Joey yung video. Pwede niyo i-post. <laughs> <laughs> Baduy na mga, nakala ko pero mag-rap uh, kayo today. Wala eh. Kailangan pa yatang, kailangan pa yatang paabuti ng gabi. Para bartender, <laughs> nabubuhay lang pag madilim na yeah. para mga ano, para mga vampira. Anyway, Glenn, thank you so much. I had a lot of salamat fun din. and I really yeah. enjoyed, you know, hearing your story. Salamat na, salamat, salamat sa pag-guest sa amin. Um, anything you need, nandito lang kami, you know, always here to support you. And thank you so much for sharing your your positive insights um, and your story here on Drink Manila. Tip your bartender. Um, I hope you can also um, invite some other of your friends who might want to be featured here on Tip Your Bartender. Anybody is, um, any, it's, it's open for everyone to be featured here. So, kung meron kayong businesses that you want to be featured, you guys have a bartending background, you know, we're all out here to support you. Um, send us a message, send us a post, a picture, and, and tag us. Parang ginawa lang ni Glenn. Uh, and uh, I hope to see you guys on Wednesday. Wednesday, Glenn pala, if you were interested in yung guest namin, for Drink Manila Happy Hour for uh, yung Plus One. My guest is uh, Mr. Ste Stefan Berg, the founder of Bitter, to uh, Bitter Truth. So if you guys want to learn more about bitters also, uh, how to use them, history, uh, interesting uh, interesting information and about stories that happened in Germany. Very interesting. Uh, There's a lot of insight sa, sa amin. So I hope you guys can join us then on Wednesday. And thanks again, uh, Glenn. Cheers, Tayo. Cheers. Cheers again for joining us. Please come and uh, follow Drink Manila on Instagram. We're also on YouTube. Please hit that subscribe button. And please join us on Wednesday and Friday. Um, and I hope you guys have a great weekend. Glenn, cheers. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Tagay. Cheers. And see you again. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you.